How's it going? It's Brad Stein with AftermarketTractorParts.com. Uh, today we got a New Holland 8670. So I scoured the internet to see how to turn this thing up and uh, couldn't find nothing. So I did not research and we're going to do it anyhow. So I'll give you a little quick uh, insight on how to turn these up on the dyno to get a little more horse. We're going for 10%, not much more. So if Adam zooms on in here, back side of the pump, there's four screws. Um, Take them four screws out, there'll be a bumper screw in there with a jam nut. Loosen the jam nut and tighten up the screw. Um, I'm gonna run, I'll run on the dyno now and see what kind of horsepower I got. And then we're gonna go 10% from there. Um, unfortunately, if you're gonna try to get into it, you need these fancy five point uh, tamper proof Torx Plus sockets. So if uh, somebody wonders why it costs so much to turn up a tractor, there's a good reason why. So, um, <laughs> We're going to run it now on the dyno, we'll get our baseline, then we're going to crank it up, and I'll show you what we got after that. Okay, Thanks. We're back. Um, unfortunately, my cameraman left me. He had to go on a service call. So we turned uh, the 8670 forward up. Um, the horsepower on the baseline when it started was 170, and I think that's what it's factory set from. So we went in here, we turned our screw. There's The screw that you turn is the lower screw. It's got a flathead tip and a 10 millimeter um, jam nut. So loosen the jam nut. We actually turned it in three quarters of a turn, um, which gave us 25 horse. So we went from 170 to 195. Uh, worked out the first time, it's a little more than 10%, but uh, didn't seem to spill much. I'm gonna run it on the dyno for maybe an hour and make sure it don't heat up, um, but I don't think we'll have any issues. So yeah, if you ever get into where you need to turn one of these up, I don't recommend it. Honestly, if uh, you need more horsepower, buy a bigger tractor. That's what you're supposed to say, right? But if you need to turn one up, now you know how to do it. So good luck. Thanks.